What's up everyone? This is The Real Mark Cruz and I'm here to keep it real with you on the things that matter the most, like your money, your mind, and your time. Today, I actually wanted to talk about the importance of perseverance in our lives. Of course, it is great to persevere through financial struggles and things like that, but what I'm about to share with you guys could literally apply to almost any scenario. So the other day, I was recalling my past with one of my friends, right? And we were just reminiscing as uh, we were reminiscing on how far we've come, you know, from the time we met years ago. We've been through so much and so much drama and so much tribulation, right? That um, it was just amazing to reminisce and to look at how far we've come. Um, it's unbelievable to look at it now, but some of those things that we had to fight through literally would have broken a person down who wasn't strong enough to fight through it or to persevere. Um, what triggered this, uh, or what triggered this thought or the conversation that we had was this uh, funny video that I had just seen that was going around. You guys probably saw it. Um, it showed this dude, he was pulling a sheep out of like a hole or a crevice, right? And um, <laughs> once he pulled the sheep out, uh, like a dork, the sheep literally kind of ran a few feet and boop, jumped right, it literally jumped right back into that hole. Um, this meme, ironically, uh, it reminded me of the times that I was so screwed financially, you know? Um, like that sheep, I had made a series of bad choices over and over again. And for the life of me, I just couldn't stop myself from repeating that cycle. Um, so many times I dig myself out of one, you know, like Bill, to have a little bit of breathing room and then boom, like a fool, I dig myself in a new hole. Um, and that sheep reminded me of myself and the stupidity that I had continued to repeat in my life. In the midst of that though, um, I also reminisced on the times I've also had near-death experiences, major health issues, and other scenarios where at those times I literally saw no way out. Um, my ability to find an escape or a solution back then, it seemed impossible to find. See, I'm sure that you, the beautiful person watching this right now, maybe you might be going through a tough time. Maybe you're struggling with a bit of depression from the pandemic since, you know, we've been cooped up for the last year. The fact that maybe you have had minimal human contact or like your sense of a routine or normalcy. Maybe those things have been disrupted so bad because of all of this. Maybe you're going through an extremely tough financial time that you just can't seem to get ahead of no matter how hard you try. Maybe those bills are drowning you and you just can't seem to get a break to breathe just a little above water. Maybe your health isn't where it should be, or you put on a few more pounds with some extra snacks that you probably shouldn't have been eating. Um, maybe you are struggling with a loved one over a misunderstanding, or you're just trying to get through to them, even though they just won't seem to listen. Listen, regardless of what your situation is, one of the things that's helped me and I'm sure that can help you is your ability to persevere and push through no matter what, right? The recovery, it all starts with your why. Why do you want to get out of that financial mess or that depression or that struggle or any of those things, you know? What is waiting for you on the other side of this mountain that you are currently climbing? Ask yourself, what is the reason that is pulling you through to the light to finally see the end of this struggle. See, my friends, times will be tough, right? And the onslaught of reasons like for you to give up, they will continue to harass you relentlessly. Those things are part of the process. But can your why be stronger than your why not? Will it have the strength to literally outweigh anything that may attempt to try to take you down? See. The thing that eventually led me out of those things was the perseverance I had instilled and built in myself from when I was a young boy. Trials, struggles, tribulations, you name it. All of those things are a part of our lives and regardless of what we do or how we live, you're going to have to deal with these things. You can be the most amazing person or you can be literally a complete jerk and struggles will still happen in our lives. Unfortunately, these things are inevitable. You can't avoid them. How you respond to those struggles is really going to help to dictate the type of person that you become. See, there's this quote from Thomas Edison, right, that I always recall when things get tough. He said, 
Many of life's failures are people who did not realize how close they were to success when they gave up. Um, you may not see it now, right? But your turning point or your breakthrough could literally be around the corner. Having that faith that things do eventually turn around can literally be all the difference between you pulling through or you pulling out. See, there were days where I had 10 bucks in my pocket, right? And there were other days where I had about six figures in my pocket. And the funny thing is, no one could tell the difference. You know why? It was because I had the perseverance to push through and to fight through all that noise right till I got to my goal. Listen, yes, I know it sucks that life can be tough and at times it can even be unbearable. But at the end of the day, we can only control so many things in our life. Find the strength to push through no matter what you face. Find the reason why you have to make it through despite what obstacles are in your way. Then, and only then my friends, will you have the perseverance that you need to make it out on top. Well, that's what I have for you guys today. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share with someone who might benefit from this information. With that said, keep your heads bright, your wallets tight, and grab your dreams like it's your right, my friends. Peace.